her. <laughs> uh, Corey is checking out uh, the gear at this uh, new survival store out in Scottsdale. I could use that thing, Corey. Rick, you are going to love what we've got to show you. W whether you are you know, a casual camper or whether you're really uh, preparing for uh, an uncertain future, this is the place for you. Uh, their motto is uh, prepare for the worst, hope for the best. But uh, here you see their logo. It's gear up. And uh, Tim Ralston is with us. And Tim, you are no stranger to the television world. Doomsday Prepper, that uh, terrific Nat Geo show. Yeah. And congrats on your new role there. Give Thanks. us 10 seconds on that. Well, they're basically uh, taking this worldwide. So there'll be 172 countries. Uh, translated in 35 languages, so it's going to kind of hopefully take the world by storm. Who knows? Yeah, exciting times. Well, you've got a beautiful layout here. Your store isn't even open yet, but uh, thanks for letting us come in and yeah. kind of preview things for everybody. Let's take a look at some of the the cool items that you've got that you're not going to find every place. No, no. Let's no. start up here. Yeah, what, what we've got over here, it's a brand new tac light company, and basically that flashlight right there you're holding mm -hmm. is the most powerful one on the market. It's not or 800 looms, and basically what you do when you hit it, that basically Holy will just, dis I know, it'll disorient uh, anybody coming in your house, so it's really kind of a, a weapon to be able to help you get away. Wow, so, so or, that right in someone's face give is... Give you that split second to be able to get away and to uh, make it out, or if you have to fight for your life, you could do that. All right, and we showed this a little bit yeah, earlier as well. This is fascinating to me. Yeah, this one is amazing, you know, because when you're out in the wilderness, if you run out of batteries, that's the worst thing. Mm -hmm. If you don't have light, this will, if your battery is in your flashlight is all the way to zero, it'll only take three hours to charge that and you'll have up to five hours of continual use on it and that's 120 looms it will brighten up the darkest night wow. and what about cell phones this will charge all kinds of things exactly anything that has a usb cord you can uh -huh. disconnect right in there and it also charges this set of four AAA batteries so if you don't have it you can uh, charge up those batteries as cool. well so all right. and how about and if you have basically no light at all these are night vision goggles i love these these are so <laughs> cool not a ton of uses for them but you know i love them this one of those cool gadgets sure um this one here this is fascinating brand to me. new brand new that one is uh, a patented new water bottle and what made it so interesting to me is that it's the very first plastic that you can actually put right over the flame and oh, you can yeah. actually sterilize and heat your water uh but it um is uh it, you know it it keeps the uh, bacteria down in here. You can heat the bottle up, like I said, or freeze it. Um, so it has a lot more uses. And when it's empty, you can roll it up and put it back into this little um, keychain and reduces up space. It's just well, and that's, amazing. That's a big part of of your world. It's reducing things in yeah. in size and shape Multiple and, and usage exactly. Right. And, and we test everything. This is kind of our display store that mm -hmm. is where we vet everything before we you know go and bring it to market. Mm -hmm. Now I, I want to. Give folks a look at these two sure. packs that you've got here. Th this is, uh, we have just about 30 seconds here. Tell me about this. This is your seven day bug out kit. And basically, we're going to be putting these kits together so that you'll be able to go anywhere in any disaster situation or the woods and survive seven days with no problem. It does come with the NAX. Which this is, is brand new. Brand new. Just invented that one. It'll hit the market in about seven days. It's knife, axe, um, machete all into one. Wow, you can swing that with uh, two hands. And of course, the Kroval, yeah. everybody's, Rick loves this thing. Yeah, Comes Kroval. in two styles, I see. Yeah, that's a Kroval Tactical that is a fixed blade system. It's about two and a half pounds lighter than the Kroval Extreme. Mm -hmm. This one is the one that uh, has made it really popular worldwide. Well, Rick is nothing if not extreme, so yeah. I, you've probably seen yeah. some of his there work on the uh, on the internet. All right, next time we get together, <laughs> Rick, we're going to, uh, yeah, I think we'll we'll show off the uh, the extreme, Rick. Uh, we'll see what uh, what else they've got in here. And you can just stand in here all day. There's something yes. uh, cool to look at everywhere you go. That water bottle crowbar. is so cool. The, the water that bottle can, is great. Yeah. You can, you it's it's, it's it made out of the same material. You know, you've got those flexible cookie sheets and so forth now. Oh. So you yeah. can, yeah, you can boil water in. It's the bubi. See, there's an umlaut oh. over it. Oh yeah. B oh. It's the it's the bubi. 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 I think they're just trying to trick people into yeah. saying the word. <laughs> Bee -bee. Germans. <laughs> They've got a sense of humor, but it's minimal. It's oh, minimal. Now, now. I can't. Ich will mir kündigen dein Lob von einem Geschlechte hin zum anderen zu Bibi. Wiedersehen.
All right, right now it's 8:54. Corey is out at Gear Up. It's this new survival store in Scottsdale. And Corey, really, is there chicken and pork that lasts for 15 years? Uh, we'll find out. Ooh, I don't about know about About 15 that. years from now. Uh, it's impressive. They've okay. got uh, food items here that they'll keep uh, virtually uh, forever. Now, hopefully 15 years from now, you won't need to tap into it. But if you have to, uh, you can. You see what I've got on my back here? This is a pack that will allow you literally to live in the wild, if you must, for three months. It's impressive. And uh, Tim, I'm going to ask you to divest me of this uh, option. It's, uh, it's pretty impressive on the heavy side. Stand by. Ugh. But uh, go ahead and throw that down there. Uh, you were saying you, everything in this store, miniaturized, compact, yeah. uh, m uh, it serves its purpose and really nothing more than that. And... Uh, it's everything is sleek and slick. Who's your typical customer? Why is someone purchasing items like this? Well, you know, it goes from your average person that's uh, looking to, you know, go out and do some weekend cap uh, camping, uh, as well as your people that look to see that, uh, hey, there could be something worse, uh, you know, in the horizon. That, and, you know, right now, my main customer has been soccer moms. The soccer moms are the ones that, you know, are, I guess, burdened with the decision of, okay, you know, we've got to look at the worst case scenario and I want to make sure that my family has food, water, mm -hmm. and the appropriate uh, survival gear like first aid and that stuff. It's so, not out of the question, you know, when your power goes out, we just saw that situation in India, oh, yeah. uh, like more people than the population of the United States without uh, power. Oh, yeah. And uh, if that lasts for a while, you, uh, it's good to be prepped. Oh eh? yeah, you know, if there's a natural disaster, we have about three days before every grocery store is basically mm. empty. So if you haven't had it, you know, it's going to be tough getting and the last thing I ever want my kids to do is look me in the eye and say, Dad, I'm hungry yeah. or I'm scared. Right. So it's just, you know, preparing for the worst and hoping for the best. Really. And you've got items for literally everybody. I yeah. love this, that we just have enough time to describe what we're looking at above our heads. Yeah, Tell it, me about this. It's a uh, jungle uh, tent hammock. And basically the great thing about three days before every grocery store is basically mm. empty. So if you haven't had it, you know, it's going to be tough getting it. And the last thing I ever want my kids to do is look me in the eye and say, Dad, I'm hungry yeah. or I'm scared. Right. So it's just, you know, preparing for the worst and hoping for the best. Yeah. Really. And you've got items for literally everybody. I yeah. love this, that we just have enough time to describe what we're looking at above our heads. Yeah, Tell it, me about this. It's a uh, jungle uh, tent hammock. And basically the great thing about this is it allows you to get off of the elements. It allows you to stay off of the frozen ground, wet ground, and keeps you away from the those creepy crawlers that mm. are out there and you get a great night's sleep with this thing it's amazing it's the mosquito netting keeps all the bugs out and the uh, roof up there keeps all the rain in love it all right quickly your your uh, location your cross streets here uh we're really close to um frank lloyd wright and uh, shea boulevard right behind the blue adobe restaurant very good all right the place is gear up and uh we'll get you linked up uh to their website at myfoxphoenix.com so rick I'm telling you, we got it for you. I know you're an outdoorsman. Yes, I am. You get a cut, a, a bruise, an abrasion, even a contusion. Oh, we can contusions get you. happen. I, w I want one of those night vision goggles. I'd use that in my call. Sure, you do. <laughs> These are the x-ray specs of the 21st century, Rick. You're gonna that get... stuff didn't work. You're, you know, you're trying to buy something out of the back of the grit. Well, you're not, they don't work. That and your surveillance cameras. Deal. You're going to get a name for yourself in the neighborhood. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Thanks, Cor. <laughs>